June, fuck off, or I implant my blade in your ribs. Just try, Gonk. Come on, let's see what you got. Well, just got real fucking interesting. Yeah! <laughs> What just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I, I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? Because you would have caught a beady. This fucking town, these people? Here, for your trouble. The rest, uh... Bartender got the rest. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in, Vic. Yeah, well, not all heroes. How about we drink to you, then? Won't say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go. Ten years married, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go. Anyhow, since you brought up money. Run me through it. Good lady did away him. Sure she's... Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Size that. Used to be. E Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around. She works nearby. Like at this city. Wait. Colorful. Always. Why you want? What's the? Simple one. I want to look him in the eyes. Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero, V. Means a lot to me. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was an unfaithful woman. I arrived on the scene, looking for the woman in the pink jacket. You about done. The woman I'm trying to with focus. a sordid past. Stop right there. They say all dames are the same, but this one, she was different. You having fun there? Put a fucking plug in it. Got too close. Almost scared the dame off. Better be careful. I know, I know.
got too close. Again. Something just drew me to her, like one magnet to another. Ugh, stop. 